WQ pipe cutting machine series, primarily for cutting of seamless steel tubes, galvanized pipes, plastic lined pipes, etc. Work range of TWQ3, 2 inches to 12 inches. Maximum wall thickness, 10 millimeters. Output speed of motor, 23 RPM. Work range of TWQ4, 6 inches to 16 inches. Maximum wall thickness, 12 millimeters. Output speed of motor, 23 RPM. Work range of TWQ5, 2 inches to 8 inches. Maximum wall thickness, 6 millimeters. Output speed of motor, 23 RPM. TWQ voice narration for presentation of TWQ3 pipe cutting machines. Measure the cutting length of steel tube and make a mark. Check the length of steel tube. The stand shall be put at a position equal to three quarters of the cutting length of the steel tube. Place the to be cut end of the steel tube on the roller of the machine and place the other end on the roller of stand. Rotate the steel tube manually to check for wandering. If yes, please vary the up or down and left or right position of the stand. Turn the relief valve of oil pump clockwise and hold the handle tightly to push downward and don't relieve until the blade approaches the steel tube. The blade will stay at the cutting position by itself. Turn on the power switch. Rotate the handle of oil pump quickly to let the blade cut a trace on the surface of steel tube in order to check for wandering. If significant wandering is found, you shall turn off power, open the relief valve of oil pump, and readjust the stand before further operation. After the adjustment is finished, start cutting the pipe again. The steel tube shall rotate at least for one turn for each turning of the oil pump handle. It may take about two minutes for cutting of 133 mm diameter steel tube. When the steel tube is approaching its breaking point, you shall stop operating the handle. The blade will continue rotating by itself so as to cut the steel tube completely. After the steel tube has been cut, you shall open the relief valve of the oil pump and the blade will return to its original highest position. For replacement of blades, you shall loosen the four screws on the blade, remove the old blades and replace with new ones before retightening the screws. Never loosen the round nut of main shaft.